In Seminole County, leaders voted to ban any businesses that sell pets from puppy mills or kitten factories. And as News 6's Clay Lepard shows us, leaders say it was the perfect time to push the ordinance through. It didn't take long as Seminole County leaders approved an ordinance that prohibits businesses to sell dogs and cats that come from kitten factories and puppy mills. With a sea of signs behind her, Winter Springs resident Carla Wilson brought up the idea to the county about a year ago. When I saw that so many uh, communities around the country were adopting similar ordinances and we currently did not have pet stores here in Seminole County, I thought the time was right. The ordinance does not affect local reputable breeders from selling directly to pet owners, but it does require any retail business looking to sell cats or dogs to use animals that come from shelters like this one here in Seminole County. Seminole County residents um, really have no business buying animals from pet stores. When you look at the number of animals that are euthanized every year in the Central Florida shelters. Right now in Seminole County, there aren't any pet stores that would be directly affected by this ordinance, which is why county leaders say now was the best time to push this. There have been um, opportunities for puppy mills to come into various counties. We just want to ensure that it's not going to be ours. The group behind the ordinance now hopes cities in Seminole County will follow suit with ordinances of their own. In Seminole County, Clay Lepard, News 6.